Hi guys, I'm Izzy. And I'm Jake. And last year we quit our jobs in England and booked a one-way flight to start backpacking around the world. We spent the first seven months of our journey backpacking around Asia and then in January this year we booked a flight to Sydney, Australia. We've been making videos and documenting our journey every step of the way, so if you'd like to join us please subscribe and enjoy today's video. Everybody. Good morning guys, or good afternoon shall we say, because we are sleepy people. Um, so we've just travelled from Mission mm -hmm. Beach and we've okay. just arrived at Cairns. Um, it's I know we, it was only an hour and a half on the bus, mm -hmm. but th the heat is totally different. Like I've walked out earlier on to be a good boyfriend and get Isabel some breakfast and a chocolate milk and stuff. And I literally came back and Izzy, I was sweating. Really hot. I was absolutely sweating. It was hot when we got here yesterday and we yeah. were walking around for a bit, but... Um, Cairns is really not what we expected. Not we thought all. it was going to be like a really big city, kind like, of like Brisbane. Mm, skyscrapers and stuff. Yeah, 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 nothing like that at all. If anything, from what we've seen so far, it's similar to Townsville. Yeah. Uh, we're going to walk to the beach today, which means we're kind of walking through a lot of Cairns, which means we'll get a better idea See of what it's more. like. But it's like surrounded by mountains, isn't it, and the rainforests. And then it's like this tiny little city. I, I don't know, because there's no like tall buildings. Which is a good job there's not tall building because the day we arrived to Cairns, a woman was telling us, oh yeah, a helicopter crashed into one of the most popular um, hotels on Esplanade. Yeah. And then I was Googling it, it and a helicopter literally, yeah. it got it was a stolen helicopter. Bloody Australians. A stolen helicopter? <laughs> a stolen. A stolen. A, yeah. <laughs> I always said stolen. <laughs> A stolen helicopter, the person nicked it, and then he's crashed into a hotel. And that sounds bad, but luckily he was the only one that died and no one else did. Um, but yeah, so me and Isabel are now going to go walk the beach. Mm -hmm. um, See what it's like. Enjoy the sun if we're too hot because Isabel's ginger and pale. We're going to have to come back and put some cream on it. Yeah. Um, but overall, we're feeling really good today and we're feeling yeah. really happy and I'm excited to go explore Cairns. Yeah, so today's video is all about our time in Cairns. We don't have anything booked like tours or anything, um, but We'll just see what just see what the day brings. See what happens. Yes, yeah. um, we're here for a while, so mm -hmm. that's today's video. Thank Enjoy. you very much, guys. to a shopping mall just two minutes up the road to get a few things. Um, when we go to the wedding they're having a white party one night so we need to get Jake a white shirt. Um, we got it from Kmart and I got myself a bikini as well. Um, crazy that it's so much cheaper there because I was looking online last night at a store called Gander. It's like a really popular shop here in Australia. Um, and like all the sale items were like so cheap and I was like oh that's so good like I'll just go to the store tomorrow and I see if they've got like any but it'd probably be a little bit more than the sales online but I thought it would be like similar <laughs> like so on sale these things were like 10 to 15 dollars and then we got there and everything even on sale was like 30 dollars and then the full price items were like 50. Um, to get a bikini from there it would have been like 40 dollars for like both things and I got a set from Kmart for like 25 so yeah keep that in mind <laughs> um, that's why I usually just buy from charity shops but the only thing I I can never buy from charity shops as shoes because they never have my size and underwear and bikinis slash footwear are just things I maybe feel a little bit weirder about buying second hand so I do always try and look out for shops but thank god they had a cheaper store otherwise I would have had to go to a charity shop because those prices were crazy uh, but yeah it's really hot here so we're just um, chilling through like the main heat of the day and then like going for walks like before and after because it's so hot and we go to Port Douglas soon so yeah.
from the night markets in Cairns and open from 4.30 so we went about 5. Uh, just have a little look around, they had some really cute stalls. We got a few gifts for some people um, that we're going to be seeing soon, uh, which was really nice. We really wanted to do that. Um, and yeah, it's been really cool. It is definitely a, an interesting vibe being in Cairns. It's definitely different to the other cities we've been to in Australia. And it is kind of crazy to think that like there are a lot of animals up here that can potentially kill you, um, which is always an interesting thought. Um, from like jellyfish, crocodiles and sharks in the sea, you've got the snakes and the spiders, so yeah, you've got like the little octopus things that like, is it like a blue ring octopus or something that I saw a TikTok about and apparently they can kill you, so uh, yeah, it's always an interesting um, vibe, but actually touch wood, let me just knock on the, the ledge there, uh, touch wood, we actually haven't come across many wild dangerous animals at all, uh, apart from in a zoo, and they're supposed to be there. We've not seen any spiders, no big spiders. Um, we saw like a red backpack where we were working, um, but that was like outside. Um, so we actually feel like we've been really lucky because as someone that really doesn't like creepy crawlies, I am very happy to have not seen any insects like that. Um, snakes, maybe it would have been cool to see like a snake or something, but definitely not too close and definitely not one of the venomous ones. Uh, when we go to Port Douglas, we're actually going on a crocodile tour, so we're hoping to see some wild crocodiles there, which will be really cool. Um, but apart from that, we've seen like wild kangaroos, wallabies, uh, whales, um, and think like all the really good animals you want to see in the wild, which has been really nice. Um, but yeah, Cairns is definitely a really cool vibe really hot and this is winter so i can only imagine how hot it gets in summer here um and yeah it's just a really nice place to be <music> time it is because we've slept very late we are now on our last day of australia for now come back but we are now off to cyprus um my brother gets married um i'm really nervous because it's such a long flight, long flight yeah. how long is it as well uh it's 15 hours to qatar and then a further four hours four hours from cyprus. cyprus from qatar so it's a long Longest bloody flight and, and i bloody hate flying so Really, it's a good come. We're going with Qatar, so it's gonna be really. It's gonna be nice. fine. Get some food, movies, yeah. and stuff. It's just, just a bit nervous before it. But I'm really looking forward to seeing my family and stuff. Mm -hmm. That's gonna be really good. Really looking forward for like a holiday, holiday because yeah. like obviously Australia has been a holiday for mm -hmm. us. But like packing always doesn't feel like a holiday. Yeah. Like you, you know, you're seeing things that are like amazing and stuff, but it's traveling. It's not like vacationing. Yes, yeah, yeah. I feel like they are very different. Yeah. And so Cyprus is definitely going to be like a nice holiday. But what did you think of Cairns? Cairns is beautiful. I really like Cairns. There was something about it. I don't know what it was. It wasn't much to do for us. We didn't really find much. To, but there was just something about it, the aura. Mm -hmm. Minus a thousand, you know. It was really yeah, good. It was nice the first couple of days we were there. And then when we came back after Port Douglas, uh, the weather wasn't very good, was it? No, nah, it wasn't at all. So it felt just like... Um, it was very humid. Yeah. And it rained a bit. Yeah. So yeah. it wasn't the best that way. But we've had a mint two months like the best two months of my life um and cyprus is gonna be good and then it's back and then back to work and yeah. back to working for I me yeah isabel's gonna travel traveling. a bit longer her mum's flying over from england so that's gonna be amazing i can't remember really wait mm -hmm. for that it's gonna be really good um but yeah um we're gonna end today's video here we hope you enjoyed seeing our time in cairns if you did please give it a thumbs up and we're next gonna be in cyprus if we survive the plane oh, don't say that. <laughs> but yeah please subscribe and we will see you in the next one Jesus. <laughs> oh, my oh, the icons just come on. Peace out, hotel. Peace out. What is it? Peace out, hotel. Oh, no, Peace out, A town. A town. Dun, dun, dun. Okay. <laughs> oh, shut up.